Hi, welcome to an overview of cash flow forecasting in Dynamics Nav. Cash flow forecasting is an estimate of the amount of money that you expect to flow in and out of your business, and it includes all of your forecasted income and expenses. You're able to view your cash flow in the key performance indicator section of your dashboard. Starting dates, period length, and different group types can be customized by the user. For example, let us filter this cash flow by quarter. Greater detail can be viewed when hovering over the different parts of the graph relating to the different cash flows. The graphical view forecast makes short-term management for cash flow much more transparent to management as to whether your business will struggle to pay vendors and expenses or if liquidity will be too high in certain periods. There are two things that you must have set up beforehand in order to generate your cash flow forecast. You first need to set up your chart of cash flow accounts found in the advanced finance module. In the cash flow forecast, the individual values that affect the cash flow of your company are arranged by using cash flow accounts. Some of these accounts are linked to one or more GL accounts. In the GL account filter field, enter filters specify that only the entries that are registered to the filter account are included in the cash flow forecast. For example, if we take a look at the receivable account, you can see that we've linked the 13,000 accounts because they relate to accounts receivable. When a cash flow account is integrated with the general ledger, either the balances of the general ledger accounts or the budget values are included in the cash flow forecast. So once you have the chart of cash flow account set up, you must now set up your cash flow. When you use the Suggest Worksheet Line Batch Job to make cash flow forecast, you must make sure that the relevant information in the cash flow forecast appears in the correct accounts. Therefore, you must establish which cash flow accounts should be used for the entries in the areas of general ledger, purchase, sales, service, and fixed assets. For example, my receivable cash flow account number is linked to my receivable account in the chart of cash flow accounts. Once this is set up, you can now look at your cash flow forecasting. When you create a cash flow forecast, you will need to enter information such as the description if you want any of these options to be considered and the appropriate dates. The cash flow number is automatically generated. You also have the option to view this forecast in your dashboard if you tick off the show in chart on role center option. To get started, click cash flow worksheet in the ribbon. In the cash flow worksheet, you register the forecasted transaction of cash inflows and outflows periodically with a batch job. You can manually edit the registered cash inflows and outflows and enter additional lines. To add cash flows to this list, select the suggest worksheet line function from in the ribbon. As we can see, cash flows such as liquid funds, receivables, sales, service orders, payables, and purchase orders will appear. Tick the boxes that you want to be a part of this forecast and then select OK. The worksheet has thus been adjusted according to what we have filtered. Financial also allows for logical forecasting. This means that you can edit the amount in receivables to what you expect debitors to pay or edit payables or expenses to what you expect to pay creditors. This can be adjusted at any time for realistic forecasts to be made. For example, you may be expecting to receive only $1,000 from this customer, so adjust the amount accordingly. Select the register from the ribbon if you're happy with the worksheet. There are different ways that you can view this forecast. I first showed you how to view it in the chart form on your dashboard, but you can review it in either a PDF, Word, or Excel if you click on cash flow date list in the report section of your ribbon. And if you preview it, here's the report. You can view the cash flow forecast stats on the navigation pane and drill down into each section. 
or you can look at the cash flow availability by specific period. And that concludes an overview of cash flow forecasting in Dynamics Nav. Thanks for watching.